coverage you can count on continues with Storm Team 10's Aaron Peters. Good Sunday evening. We had a beautiful sunny day today. It was a great day if you had to go out, run errands, maybe grocery shopping. Take a live look outside Storm Team 10 Storm Tracker. We see a mostly clear sky with a few clouds here and there. For the most part, though, let's take a look at what I'm tracking. We're going to have a partly cloudy sky tonight. We're going to have a clear day tomorrow morning. But as we get into the afternoon, evening hours, we are seeing a chance of showers. And overall, through these next week or so, we are going to have roller coaster temperatures. So take a look at the temperature trend for you. Average high is around 40 degrees. We've seen warmer temperatures these last couple days. You're going to see temperatures in the 40s these next two days. 44 tomorrow, 46 on Tuesday. See your temperatures just gradually getting warmer, getting to the 50s by Wednesday and Thursday. But Thursday also brings a chance of precipitation similar to Monday. That's going to bring in a cold front as well, dropping our high to just 43 degrees on Friday. So look at the future cast to track out how our Monday is supposed to shape up. This is at 6 a.m. I mentioned a clear start to tomorrow morning. Could even see a little bit of sunshine as we get to the afternoon hours. That's when you could see those clouds and that chance of rain move in. This is at noon. See some of these clouds move in and eventually by the time we get into tomorrow evening, we could see a chance of rain in the Wabash Valley as well. As you get into Tuesday though, these clouds and that chance of precipitation will be moving out. We're going to see that sunshine return for our Tuesday and it should shape up to be a somewhat dry and somewhat cool day as well. So look at precipitation chances for you. 50% tomorrow. Keep in mind that's going to come into your afternoon into evening hours. But as you get into tomorrow night, it's going to dry off a little bit and then potentially that precipitation is going to move out by the time we get to Tuesday and Wednesday. But that chance of rain moves back into the forecast on Thursday at around 30%. And with that 30% chance of rain will come a cold front as well, dropping our highs to just the mid to low 40s on your Friday. But Friday looks like it should be staying dry. Look at the three day forecast to start off our work week. 44 tomorrow, 50% chance of rain. Keep in mind coming in the afternoon, evening hours. To get to Tuesday, it's going to be remaining dry, sunny with a high of 46. Wednesday for your Valentine's Day should be a lovely day, high of 51 and mostly sunny. And that most likely be our best day over this week as well. Look, the temperatures currently in the Wabash Valley. Majority of us in the 30s, 35 in Casey, 37 in Terre Haute and Rockville. But some of us are still in the 40s, Solvent at 41 and Lagodi at 40. As you get through the rest of tonight, overnight low around 31 degrees with a partly cloudy sky. But some of these clouds will clear out by the time we get into tomorrow morning. These clouds are going to move right back in with a chance of rain as well in the afternoon. High of just 44 tomorrow. As you get into tomorrow night, it's going to be breezy. Slight chance of rain as well. Overnight low around 28 degrees. Wind gusting up to 20 miles per hour. Look, seven day forecast high of 44 with a 50% chance of precipitation tomorrow. As getting to tomorrow night, still a slight chance of rain with the overnight low around 28, but that rain moves out for Tuesday and Wednesday. Wednesday for your Valentine's Day, high of 51 and mostly sunny.